minimum effort. Minimum effort. Minimum effort. Minimum effort. All right, hello. Hey, welcome back. See, I let you have it this time. We were telling jokes off camera. Um, terrible, terrible jokes. So, where am I going? Okay. I think no, I came in through No, this. no, don't, don't start that 9-11 diary. <laughs> well, so as you may have guessed from the previous episodes, uh, Anna's originally from New York City. So, I think she was, like, I don't know, 10 when the 9-11 happened. And she, okay, I was in the shirt. Yep. So, she kept a diary. And her perception of what happened was so horribly wrong. Oh, no. It was, it was like... Is she going to hate us for, like, you telling us and telling the story? No, she's both embarrassed about the diary, but loves telling it because it's really funny. <laughs> But, again, she's a kid. It's not like... Oh, no, no. I'm not going to sit here and judge her as a child for... I think this girl. Unless I just literally ran in a circle. I just don't want her coming (laughs) after us, like, when she watches the video and be like... (laughs) You fuckers! (laughs) (laughs) Just just so you know, Anna, if you're watching this, I did not condone this. He just kept typing it. I want to hear it. Um, Is that a zombie? uh, Maybe it's her dad. Or is that just a guy on meth? We've no, no, no. We've sorry, Florida? sorry. So, she was she was writing, like, 11 planes hit four towers and they were bleeding. <laughs> <laughs> she was like, the towers are bleeding. Wow. That is, like, that is so adorable. They, but it was spread over, like, uh, four or five pages. Of just scribbling. Was there anything in this room besides just that? Because I don't want to leave and have to come back. <laughs> I don't know. I'll use my trust. Nope. It's not turning me towards anything. I mean, okay, so I, I was actually expecting this story to be a lot worse than it was. I, I'm not going to say something like probably where you were going. But <laughs> it was just something that she wrote when she was a kid. Which as an adult you go, that's dumb as shit. <laughs> Just mock a child like it's like oh, you're so stupid. I the first time I ever oh where'd you go from the first there's one behind me I know it there's always one behind me oh yeah and nope huh. the first thing I ever wrote it was a something for a class a little English you know literature class but I was also around the same age yeah and I wrote okay I wrote a super plagiarized uh, Final Fantasy story mixed with uh, Metal Gear Solid characters. Like Psycho Manus and shit. <laughs> Fair enough. And you, I, I wrote you, it. You did your first fan fiction. Yeah, essentially it was it. <laughs> and it was, it was supposed to be like an original story. <laughs> but like, it had to be handwritten. Uh, and I waited until the night before to do it. <laughs> that, that was mostly gonna me die. and my childhood. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Yep. Wait, I picked up a green herb. Oh, you did! And a red herb! <laughs> Use. If I remember correctly, uh, red herbs like give you a little bit of armor too, right? Um, like a little bit of defense before you start taking more damage, right? That was added in later. Gotcha. They just want red herbs because they, they think Christmas. Can't blame them, I like Christmas too. Yeah, that's when the game came out. <laughs> This is a Christmas game. <laughs> Absolutely. Coming Christmas. Resident yeah. Evil. You can hear the jingle bells in the background. Jingle bells, jingle bells. If I cared more about editing, I would put jingle bells there. Instead but what it. do you think you're going to hear when this video goes up? Oh, come on. <laughs> nope. I haven't even picked up the magnum yet. Did I go around it? Uh, you know what? Honestly, I could not tell you. Yeah, seriously, like, if I would have seen that, like, kind of movement, I would have still tried to pump shells into it. This is why I'm not playing the games. <laughs> it's so funny, like, I, I thought to myself about this, like, you know, I grew up in the time of, like, Nintendo, like, when that first came out, I actually, like, owned a Nintendo, I had the Power Glove and everything like that. You had the Power Glove? Oh, yeah. Was it great? It was rad. <laughs> it was so bad. <laughs> um, You know... I I had a lot of games for it, and yet, like, 
I absolutely was not a fan of playing video games. Like, I was more interested in, like, going outside. And then the older I got, the more I didn't want to go outside and just want to play video games. What is, what is this? Uh, uh, Does this say princess? Yeah, princess. Princess. See, I want to say Media, she's Princess na- Media. I want to say she's naked because I see a belly button, but... Is that a human? I thought that was like a prairie dog. Just like, like with a buff body. You know what it is? It's a guinea pig. <laughs> <laughs> it all makes sense now. What the fuck am I doing here? But yeah, like as a kid, like I was more interested in like going out and doing stuff rather than like staying inside. Because staying inside, like I think is like I always equated it to like punishment. Like like you can't go outside. You have to stay in your room. Like if you would have told me that now, with my mindset now, I would have been like, thank you. I get to stay inside my room. <laughs> Sweet. Yeah. Thanks. You're doing me a favor here. You're grounded. Go to your room with all your game consoles. <laughs> Seriously. And the worst part is, like, as a kid, like, growing up, I always begged for, like, new consoles. And I got pretty much every one of them. Like, the Nintendo I got right off the bat. I got the Super NES and 64. And yet, like, I never played them as much as, like, I, I begged for them to get them. I started out going outside. But eventually it just turned into gaming. Yeah, exactly. That's the same thing with me. Cause... Like... Cause like I remember, like I hear people like all these all these times like around my age talking about like, oh man, Banjo Kazooie is my game and like Conquer's Bad Fur Day. And I'm like, I never actually played any of those games. Like, I had an N64. I played Mario 64, <laughs> WrestleMania 2000, which oh, that game was incredible. Um, but yeah, like like I said, like uh, and then when I actually when I got older in my teenage years, staying home and I was like watching my brother and sister, so that was like an absolute like didn't want anything to do with. So, oh, hey, liquor. So far, you've not killed one liquor. <laughs> They're just so easy to run around. Y- y- yeah, I I remember the liquors being like more of a problem. They also could kill you in one hit. That's very true. But you. In the you know in the static games where it's like the pre rendered background shit, did you can't run around them? But fuck it, I, I can do it easy. <laughs> like when I, I just go away. <laughs> oh, we're just gonna ignore that. Got it. Yeah, no, that's not a problem. That'll be a, that'll be something I'll deal with later. <laughs> it's probably Mister X. Yeah, that's fine. I'm going in a small container. See, okay, when I was younger, that freaks me out. Like, just, like, a void of blackness surrounding, like, <laughs> one container. Because you don't know what's outside there, so, like, it left your, your imagination. He, I was forced to take damage there. That's, that's bull. Thankfully, the hunter didn't just bust through the cabin. Good thing. I remember, uh... When I was... A kid, I went to one of my friends' house and they had a little fire pit. I don't have shotgun rounds. And I touched one of the, you know, embers, uh, which, you know, burned my hand. Yeah. And I went home, uh, crying for help. But I thought if I said I touched the burning coal, I'd get in trouble. I don't know why I thought this. So they were like, how did you do this? And I was like, the sun did it. It's sunburn, and it's clearly like a burn wound from touching coal. <laughs> and they're like, is it now? Yeah. <laughs> all right, so... All right, I got a story for next episode. <laughs> Unless there's danger. Oh, god damn it. Let's you know fight we'll, him next yeah, time. No. All right, yeah, we'll, we'll fight him next time. It's pause menu, those exist. All right, goodbye. Bye.